here, uh, this next uh, tune I'd like to play is um, on, the, on the Big Purple accordion. It's a song about uh, it's my favorite of the world. Shaman. Many, 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 perhaps a few too many, uh, politicians. <clears throat> May a 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 This next song is uh, in an odd key signature for American songs. It's in the um, it's in the key of uh, French. Thank <laughs> you. 
de la tour. La tour de Mayland. Thanks, guys. <laughs> yeah. With the uh, accordion block of the uh, afternoon. Uh, okay, uh, whenever I play at a, a place that has a um, piano on hand, I like to um, take advantage of that. Uh, so I'm going to play a song that I don't play in concert a lot. It's called Lucky Charm. You'll find a penny and you pick it up and all through the day you have good luck. You make a wish upon a star. You know and you never know what it will do. But the only lucky charm, 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 charm I need is you. Can I mention how to play this one very much? Okay. You'll find the nickel and you pick it up and all through the week you have such good luck. You hold a rabbit's foot in your hand. You never know what it might do, but the only lucky charm I need is My last fall, and it was 17 degrees Fahrenheit. That's what it feels like in St. Louis right now. Do you remember? Yeah. <laughs> 
uh, uh, where's the song going from there? I admit it feels good to turn the waterworks on. There it is. But if other folks see me, my pride is gone. If necessary, I'll stay in the kitchen till I'm through crying over you. I'm chopping up onions and I'll chop them up all day. I'm chopping up onions till my teardrops go away. I'm chopping up onions, now my baby's gone to stay. I'm chopping up onions, someday it'll be okay. Merchandise available. Some of it is on display on top of the piano, and some of it's on display over here. I've got records and DVDs and CDs and pillowcases and T-shirts, and pretty much all of it is five dollars. So, uh, if you want a little something, then just come up and chat with me after I'm all done here. Uh, this comes from a split record release with the band, but uh, and we each took a side of the record. Google Plexi did a side and then Butt did the other side, and each of our songs is about the other, so this is a song about Butt, uh, and the song's called Butt Release, which is kind of like a triple entendre, because, uh, of course, it's on a record um, that's been released, you know, it's a, it's a Butt Release, and um, the song itself is about Butt getting out of jail, so being released from jail, and, well, uh, if you can't think of a third meaning for Butt Release, then um, it's probably best left unsaid. Okay. <laughs>
Thanks, guys. Thank you. It's a funny picture. Okay. Oh, just a couple more, guys. Just a couple more. Uh, and we'll return you to your regularly programmed uh, smooth sounds over the speakers of the Euclid Records Superstation. Um, okay, this is a uh, song that comes from a tragicomic miniature opera I co-wrote with my friend Paul. And I've got DVDs of a live performance we did of it uh, just for $5 if you, if you like what you hear. Um, and uh, and uh, it's called The Tale of the Saber Camp. It's about an evil, gigantic fish that lives in a faraway Canadian lake. Um, so when I'm like singing the song and I kind of like mention about the saber camp, don't like raise your hand and ask like, well, what's the saber camp, you butthole? Because I just told you it's an evil fish that lives in a faraway lake. And you're the butthole, okay? No, I'm just joking. Nobody's a butthole here. We're all friends. Of course. Yeah, indeed. Okay, so a tale of the saber camp. Oh, listen to the tale of the saber camp, the demon fish of Silver Lake, with fins like knives taking countless lives. Its fiery eyes make fearless men quay. <laughs> Seek to make acquaintance of the saber cat. A curse it sure your day shall be. Though pure your intent, lest your life be spent. Threefold now comes the prophecy of the saber cat. And first, a gift you'll of gold you'll receive. Second, your clothing wet becomes totally wet becomes third and final. Transformation primal, the evil fish's curse its course has run. So I heed the dire legend of the saber can, a demon fish of silver lake, with fins like knives taking countless lives. Its fiery eyes make fearless men. I sit with fiends like knives taking countless lives. So many lives, you can never count them all. Its fiery eyes make fearless men. I'm quaking just thinking about it myself. Thanks, guys. Thank you. That was the tale of the Saber Camp. You know, like I say, available on DVD um, from a live performance in uh, Chicago. Okay, this is a song about stealing your roommate's beer um, when your roommate has drunk drunk too many of uh, his own beers to notice. Um, my roommate at the time when I wrote this song was named Daniel, um, and there's sort of a sing-along part if you guys want to join in. Uh, and my, like I say, my roommate's name was Daniel when I wrote the song, so I'm going to sing it about Daniel. But if you'd like to enact this particular form of theft against any roommate of your own, past or present, then uh, you should sing their name instead. You know, if you want to. On the chorus, which goes like this. I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, 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 cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, 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 cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep, just like that. <laughs> I was baking some brownies when Daniel came home A case of beer in his hand After looking him over I determined that He was three sheets to the wind Everyone I'm gonna drink, drink, drink Another one, one, one Of Daniel's beers, beers, beers Cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep I'm gonna drink, drink, drink Another one, one, one Of Daniel's beers, beers, beers Cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep So I sat Daniel down and we started to chat he offered to me a can of beer. Before long it was clear, Daniel was reaching his end, and he passed out on the, well, it's close enough, divan. So I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, 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 cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, 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 cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. Now I normally drink cocktails, but when the beer's free, I take the advice of my 
doctor, what's he say? He told me, don't hold back, it's complimentary. Are the pilsners, the ales, and the lagers, so I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, 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 cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, 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 cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. So I called up my friends and I told them the news. My sleeping roommate has beer. Plenty to go around, so they come to my house. Euclid Records, New Orleans. And this is the song that I hear. I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, beers, beers. Cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, beers, beers. Cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. Soon that Daniel woke up with a scowl on his face. He said, why leave me out of the fun? He motioned to the fridge. Whatever it is. As he started to laugh. Uh, uh, and said, there's plenty more where that came from. So I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, beers, beers. Cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. I'm gonna drink, drink, drink another one, one, one of Daniel's beers, beers, beers. Cause he's asleep, sleep, sleep. One more time, I'm gonna drink, drink, drink Another one, one, one I can't go beer, beer, beer Cause he's a sleep, sleep, sleep One more, I'm gonna drink, drink, drink Another one, one, one I'm getting you one more. I've come all the way from St. Louis. Um, I love New Orleans so far. We've only been here for like a matter of minutes. But uh, it's a great place and this is a great store, obviously. And um, and uh, obviously if they'll give a sucker like me a chance to play, you know, they must be doing something either very right or extremely wrong. I don't know. Uh, this last song is, um, is by a band from Iowa called The Miracles of God. When the undead come back, they're always looking good, so good. And there's always champagne and fireworks uh, in my neighborhood. And I live in a mansion at the top of a hill of the mountain.
guys on Google Plexia. Yeah. Thank you for coming. Shop, buy your records, enjoy, and have a good day. Um, if you have tickets to Comic Con, you should come see us later. I can't really re recommend buying them because they're very pricey, but uh, we'll be there doing a panel Q and A style after we screen our uh, pilot episode of our of, of our new uh, TV series. So. Um, have a good time in New Orleans, and thank you for having me, everybody. Thank you. Woo! Yeah! Yeah!